A sleep calculator reveals the exact time you should be going to bed at night based upon when you wake up in the morning. Sleep is an important aspect of life as it can impact your physical and mental health as research suggested that over 50% of adults believe they don't get enough sleep. If you don't get enough sleep then it can even increase your risk of certain serious health issues. With this in mind, experts at Make My Blinds have created the sleep calculator to help improve sleep quality around the country, as well as sharing tips on how to get a better night's sleep. Not getting enough sleep can have an impact on your overall health. A lack of sleep has been linked to poor mental health a lack of concentration, a weakened immune system and low sex drive. There are many factors that can contribute to poor sleep quality including, stress and anxiety money worries work related issues a bad diet not exercising regularly having an irregular sleeping pattern the required amount of sleep we need depends on our age as most of the population is advised to get 7 hours a night. However, small children under a year old should get between 12 and 16 hours of sleep every day. This sleep calculator will ask you for your sex and age before moving on to the sleep-related questioning. It requires you to enter your average wake-up time every day and then you get results. For example, the following results were inputted, gender, female age. 22 to 64 years wake up time, 7.30 a.m. The calculator suggested for this person to go to bed at 9.55 p.m. to get 9 hours and 15 minutes of sleep in total. The website read, you go through three stages during sleep, light, deep, and REM sleep. Experts recommend 7 to 9 hours of sleep between four to six sleep cycles for adults. Experts also recommend that women need 20 minutes more sleep than men. We've also taken 15 minutes off to account for the time it takes to fall asleep. The calculator also asks the following questions in order to give you advice on how to get a better sleep. What kind of diet do you follow? Which is your biggest meal? When do you prefer to exercise? What temperature do you usually set your thermostat at bedtime? Do you regularly consume any of these? Choices include caffeine, alcohol, nicotine and sleeping pills. Do you do any of these activities before you go to bed? Do any of these often wake you up? Do you suffer from any of these sleep conditions? Do you suffer from any of the following health conditions? How do you control the level of light in your bedroom? What position do you typically sleep? Colette Damon, interior stylist at Make My Blinds said, Getting the correct amount of sleep is vital for our physical and mental health, but for those who are struggling with sleep deprivation, it can be hard to understand what contributing factors may be to blame, making the issue worse. For many of us, we are aware that certain lifestyle habits, such as a bad diet and using technology before bed, can impact our sleep quality, as well as stress and money worries. However, the environment you're sleeping in can influence how good or bad your sleep pattern is. As lighter mornings approach, the amount of natural light entering your bedroom can disrupt your sleep quality, so it's important to make the room as dark as possible, for as long as possible. She says one of the best ways to achieve this is by investing in a blackout roller blind as they're cost effective and will help block out any natural light. Colette adds that a neat and tidy space is also a great way to relax the body and mind, which in turn will benefit your quality of sleep. Finally, your bedroom should be a place of relaxation, and technology can often make us more alert and increase our chances of having a bad night's sleep. With this in mind, consider removing any distractions from your room or make sure they're switched off long before it's time for bed, and instead, opt for a book or practice mindfulness. 
you can try out the sleep calculator yourself on the Make My Blinds website here. Join the Daily Record WhatsApp community. Get the latest news sent straight to your messages by joining our WhatsApp community today. You will receive daily updates on breaking news as well as the top headlines across Scotland. No one will be able to see who is signed up and no one can send messages except the Daily Record team. All you have to do is click here if you're on mobile, select Join Community and you're in. If you're on a desktop, simply scan the QR code above with your phone and click Join Community. We also treat our community members to special offers, promotions, and adverts from us and our partners. If you don't like our community, you can check out any time you like. To leave our community click on the name at the top of your screen and choose Exit Group. If you're curious, you can read our privacy notice.